Yo, what's up? So today we're frying chicken. Not just any chicken. We're air frying chicken. <laughs> yeah, so my last uh, deep fryer uh, died on me mid uh, chicken frying. You know, I was right into it, into my third batch of chicken, and then it just died and it was just just soggy chicken in oil so that didn't work out so well so about the air fryer air fryer is a good alternative so i was like yo let's just try it out and i'm pretty impressed so today we're gonna go ahead and do some air frying of some chicken wings you're gonna need a bowl right other thing you're going to need is some flour We're also gonna need some good old seasoning. I like to do uh, some chili powder. Oh, my favorite, seasonal. Uh, garlic powder, my mama likes to do this. This is north of Kakalaki chicken, just to let you know. If you don't know what Kakalaki is, you might as well just go ahead and Google it. Get your tail hip, uh, get you some table blend Cajun. Cool, you got your ingredients. The chicken has been cleaned. Let's go ahead and take this out. Mmm, smells like apple cider vinegar. Yum yum. Oh, ooh, ooh, ooh. This is hopefully a healthier take on fried chicken. I don't know, I need to Google that and verify if that's actually a real thing. You're ready to put this chicken in the bowl. Let's pour it all in there. So right here, I have probably like 20, 20 wings, 21 wings, something like that. Not too bad. Cool. So you got your chicken. Grab your seasons. And um, I'm sorry, this is not um, tasty. I'm not, I'm not tasty. I'm not BuzzFeed. So I'm not going to tell you any measurements. You're going to have to measure by your soul. Right. Just harness the North Kakalaki ancestors. This is a recipe straight from North Kakalaki. Uh, my mama, my mama's mama, my mama's mama's mama all made fried chicken like this. And um, every time I take this chicken out somewhere, it's a banger. I'm taking this old chicken recipe that's been delved in the deep fryers and taking a modern twist and putting it in the air fryer and seeing how that, um, how that really translates. So first you start off with table blend. Just shake that up there. Shake that up pretty good. Shake that up. Okay, good. <laughs> I don't know how many measurements you can say. It's five. Um, it's, it's less than a New York minute. That's probably what it was. And then we do the season all. You got to get the good season all in there. So look at that. Mm, 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 mm. Yeah. That's looking good. Oh, let's, let's wait for the chili powder. And this garlic powder hits. Let's do that. Ooh. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. Mm, that looks good. And now it's shit. Now the good old chili powder. Boom, 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 boom. Gotta make this bad boy have some flavor. Get some pit cool. And that's your first coat. Yeah, I know you're like, dang, bro. This chunk looks spicy, dude. Shake it up. So this is the second coating over the chicken. <clears throat> this is the last coating. If you're feeling really froggy, you can do another coating, but uh, it's not necessary. Just this many coatings should be um, be fine. Unless you want a heart attack. But since it's air fried chicken, it's healthy, right? If it's air, high, if it's air fried, it's healthy, is that a thing? I don't, I don't know. Usually I let this rest for like 30 minutes or something like that. Marinate for 30 minutes. You put it in a plastic bag, you put a cover on it or something like that. But marinating it for 30 minutes will really infuse the flavor in the chickens. So now you want to put this flour in a plastic bag so you can toss your chicken flour in the bag and then you pour it on. Just enough for the chickens we're making. Depending on how many chickens you're making, you might need more flour in there. The cool thing about the air fryer is I don't need to warm it up. I just, it's just ready to go. It's like, what's up, bro? I'm ready to go. So now we're going to just throw this in here, right? 
toss these bad boys in here. Look at that. Look at that. How many can fit in there? Probably like 10. I'm gonna say 10. One, two, three, four. Oh, 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 oh. Six. Oh. So you got them in there. And you know my favorite thing, shake it. Harlem shake it. Shake it. Cool, before we do this chicken, what I found is a game changer is um, this oil thing. This oil spray thing. Look at this, man. This right here. I think this is the secret to crispy chicken. Because the, the consistency, not even the consistency, just the appearance of the chicken in an air fryer, it looks a little bit different than deep fried chicken. I think deep fried chicken is a little more um, tan. It has a little more color. And I think that's due a lot with um, the, the oil used. So since you're using air fried chicken, a lot of people say, oh, you don't need oil. I like to spray a little bit of oil on there. And you're going to see what that looks like shortly. For sure. This is the good old air fryer right here. I got a Zini. I got a Zeni air fryer. <clears throat> so, you'll change things. So, really, really gross. It's already plugged in. So, what you do is hit that. Ah, uh, yeah. So, you can either do uh, the temperature or you can do the time. You can do all the out of the box stuff. Uh, we're gonna be doing chicken today, but the set, you know, it sets the time, time 20 minutes. Cool. We're gonna come back to that. So let's go ahead and load this. Now you're gonna load these chickens in here. Mm, look at that. And it's idiot. You should have tongs too. So this one isn't that big. It's a Zena. Zena. Zene. 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 Zena. Zena. The warrior princess. I don't know what you call this damn air fryer chicken thing man all i know is it's a deep fry it's an air fryer jump for the chick there we go hey cool plugged it in oh don't want to remember let's hit this jump blah, blah. so oh, we go through it right Can I, oh no i don't want that i want i want the chicken ah, ah, ah. Cool, so we're on chicken, it says 20 minutes. So halfway through, I'm actually gonna spray. Actually, no. Nah. Yeah. This cool thing is that I can do that and it's going to uh, it's gonna save my settings. So it shouldn't like end it, end it. We're gonna spray this a little bit, you know what I'm saying? Spray the jump. Tap to learn, I was to spray the jump. Dude, ooh, look at that. Ooh, I should probably wait. Just a little bit. There we go. There we go. Cool. Did some spraying. Now let's drop that in there. And it remembers. Cool. So we're going to wait like 10 minutes and then we're going to flip them. Cool. We're at. 11 minutes, get some tongs, pull this bad boy out very quick. Let's see what it looks like. So this is, boy, this is why I say use the oil. Cause you look at it, you're like, yo, what the heck is going on with my chickens, dog? You just need to, you just need some oil. That's all I need. Flip them jumps. They're looking fried. I, you know, like the oil, the flour thing is what kills me with these fried chickens, man. These the flour thing is what kills me. I'm like, yo, what? What? Why is the flour? What? I'll no, just, uh, yeah, just give me. There we go. Cool. So I just tossed it back in there. It's 11 minutes. Probably flip it again in five minutes. So let's have another five minute break, show. Wait, we got a hey, Google. Turn that up, man. Sorry, I can't help with that yet. <sighs> yeah. Oh, Jay Dilla. What's up? Yeah. I'm on the block. 
It's slim pickings. Wait. I'm in the kitchen. Wait. I'm frying chicken. Not the deep one. I'm talking air. You hear that? I don't care. Too, too kill, too ill, too on. You know what I'm on. Been ill since dawn, but I'm killing this cause I'm a don. Know what I'm on, but yo, things going through my head like this air fryer look like an egg. <laughs> And I'm about to see Sonic. That's not nothing ironic. I'm on a block and I'm speaking easy bonics. And everybody wanna rhyme it in time and it's time and time and again. Everybody trying to spit like I'm time and again. I'm trying to lose this dude and do it and sue it time and again. But wait, pause. <laughs> no, really, pause. Pause. Stop. Okay, we're at five minutes left. Let's see what this chicken's looking like now. Look at that. Yo, this looks like real chicken right now, B. Look at that chicken. That looks like real chicken. Good God. Go, 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 Alright. So again, you're gonna flip these bad boys. Yeah, they're getting pretty dark. Oh. You flip these bad boys so you can finish it. Because there's a little bit of, there's still a little bit of flour on some of these. That's fine. I thought I was sleep. Y'all sleeping on it. Don't sleep on this job. Oh, I'm left. I'm right-handed. God, there we go. Yeah, spray that. Okay, cool. So I'm wrap up this chicken, and now you gonna see what it looks like. The end result is gonna be fire. Just know it. But I'm gonna fry the rest of this chicken. And I'm gonna just show you the end result, and y'all can rock with it. And I'm gonna try this. There's no cackle like a chicken. All right, let's go ahead and hit this. This crisp check. Mm. So, I think last time I made these, it was a little more floury, right? Uh, and that's because I didn't have the the oil sprayer. And it's like my first. It was like my first time making fried chicken, air fried chicken. So, ooh, ooh, it's crunchy. Like, it doesn't smell like your regular, it doesn't smell like North Kakalaki fried chicken. It don't smell like it, you know? I think that smell comes from all that deep, like, canola oil, deep fried canola oil type jazz. But, you know, let's try it. Mmm. 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 Yeah. It's good. It isn't as crispy as a mm. no. It's crispy. Yeah, no, no. It's good, man. It ain't. It's, it's so it's not like North Kakalaki fried chicken with deep fried or canola oil, all that jazz. But this is good though. You know. Oh, yeah. Mm. Mm -hmm. All right, but. So this is air fried chicken. It isn't terrible. That's the that's the number one thing. It isn't you you can tell a difference. It's like it's not necessarily as big a difference as a Beyond Burger and a regular burger, but um, it's a subtle difference between deep fried oil canola oil type chicken and air fried chicken. Deep fried chicken, and air fried chicken, essentially. But um, no, it's still good. Yeah, it's still good. So, anyway, I'm hungry. I'm going to eat my fried chicken and, and make my whatever my sides or whatever. I get that figured out. So, you know, you hopefully made your chicken while you were watching this. Otherwise, you got to go and make it. Or if you want, go deep fried or go to Popeye's or something. I don't know. But, nah, this chicken go up. Or if you like a vegan, you're going to make some some tofu or some fried Brussels sprouts. Hmm. wonder if fried Brussels sprouts is a thing. It's probably not a thing. All right. Anyway, deuces. Um, maybe next time I'll teach you how to make North Kakalaki mac and cheese. But that won't be an air fryer. I'm sorry. All right. Deuces.
man, I could eat all this chicken, I swear. Mmm. Where's this? this little one don't count? <laughs> this little this this is a little wing, bro. Like, where they find? Oh, I don't want to know where they find this wing, bro. 